thine to get home and marry that baby of mine. So I went to the chaplain and the authorizing me to send for my ebony eyes. My ebony eyes was coming to me from out of the skies on dry 1203 in an hour or two I would whisper I do to my beautiful ebony eyes The plane was over you so I went this right to where I'm this and I said sir I don't know why it's still to see so late. He said, oh, they probably took off late or they may have drunk to some turbulent weather and had to alter their course. I went back outside and waited at the gate and watched the beacon light from the copper tower as it whipped through the dark and heavy skies as well searching for my heavy eyes. And then came the announcement of the last speaker with those heavy relatives of friends of flight number 12 or 3 she parted the chapel across the street at once. Then I felt the burning break deep inside, and I knew the heavenly ebony skies had taken my life's most wonderful pride. My beautiful ebony eyes Beauty.